This is Scratch, and it's pretty basic. It's used to teach little kids how to code, and I didn't think much of it. That was until I discovered this. So yeah, maybe this is a bit more advanced than I thought. I think it's only fitting that I continue my ongoing series of making D minus minus worse. The obvious name is, of course, Scra D minus minus. So how am I going to do this? Well, I think the key is going to be Scratch as a list feature, which is basically just an array. I'm going to loop through the list and check what the value is, and then do a command based on that. So let's try it. Brawlberry is a co-op roguelike dungeon crawler where every encounter is a completely unique boss fight. Unlock powerful upgrades with your friends as you battle through the Fruitscape. Wishlist on Steam today, link in the description. Back to the video. Alright, I now have it executing commands. Right now, all I have is move right and stop, but it's pretty easy to add more, so let's do that. Alright, after a lot of copy-pasting, we have the following. Now you might be wondering where is if statements and for loops? They were in the original and the emoji version. Where are they here? Well, the sad truth is that I couldn't figure them out. They were just too difficult. So yeah, we now have if statements and for loops, which is really surprising. Well, the good news is that I can make something pretty cool now. Something I couldn't do in the original. Alright, let's do this. So, the plan is I'm going to make a side scroller platformer controller, which, yes, is possible. And that should be our side-scroller platformer controller, so let's try it out. Let's try and make a jump. We go up, and we... So, the floor kind of sometimes goes up, because of like the weird... the such the low frame rate. But yeah, other than that, it, it works, definitely. It's completely flawless, and this is the best programming language. 